Hello everybody and welcome to Art for Everyone. Today what we're going to be making is this this beautiful fox. We'll be learning how to decorate a little bit and uh, this can just stand like that and it looks usually very very good on a mantel piece or just as a decoration or if you want to play with it like that. Right, to start with, we will need ourselves a origami paper, square, and uh, to get us going, what we're going to do is we're going to fold this corner to corner, just flatten it out, and then we're just going to fold this in half again, corner to corner, just push that form down. And then we can open this back out. And then we've got this corner here going to the top. This edge here going into the center. We'll just do that one. And then same with this side, this corner going to the top, this edge going into the center. As, as neat as possible, always helps I guess. Right, and then we're going to fold it in half. So we're going to, on, on the opposite side of where the opening is, so this side, we're going to fold it in half. We're going to bring these two edges, uh, these two corners together. Just press down. Then we're going to go about a third in. Right, and we're going to grab this piece here, and we're going to fold it down that way, but making sure that the fold goes from a third there into that corner. So we go like this, about a third, and into that corner, and then same on this side about a third into that corner mm -hmm. oh, there you go and then what we want to do is we want to push this down so we're going to get this bit that's left push that down mm -hmm. and bring that into the center just connect it there and then just pull all of it together into this side and that's the front of our fox so you can see there two foxes look very similar just make sure that this is folded and it goes all the way down to that corner again on the inside and then all you want to do is get the tail about a third of this length here just fold it on itself so that oh, that edge is folding onto itself like that mm -hmm. and that's the fox ready to go you can just bend these ears in a little it gives us a better look and then all we need is a pen draw on some eyes Good stuff. The good thing here is we've got that fold in the middle, so we can try and make it as symmetrical as possible. Even though I'm really bad at it, <laughs> give it a filled out nose. Yep. Give it some eyebrows. Now the eyebrows are really good because they will give you, uh, the depending on what kind of eyebrows you draw, it will give it that particular character. So. With this one, I've drawn him going downwards, so he looks a little bit angry or mischievous. Um, in this particular case, we can just do... something like that. And that is our relaxed and chilled out fox. So, thank you everybody for watching. 
Um, please like, subscribe, and see you for the next one. Woo!